In Psalm 111, verse 10, there are three explanations of the utmost importance for us. Shall we read them now? The first one is this. The psalmist said, The fear of the Lord is the beginning of wisdom. When you need wisdom, fear God. Respect what he said. If you don't fear him, you will not be successful. What if God says something contrary to what I want? Let not your will be done, but his. Second statement, a good understanding have all those who do his commandments. It means that all those who obey God will have a good understanding. And the others, they won't have a good understanding. Because if God does not provide you with understanding, if he doesn't enlighten you, you will know nothing, and by sticking to that which you think you know, you will do what is wrong. Third, his praise endures forever. So remember, I praise God when I was 10 years old. When I was 20, I was 50. I must always praise God for what he did and for what he is doing. This praise endures forever. My praise is in his presence and will never remain this way. Take a look at this person who was blessed, and I'll be right back. I had a condition called epicondylitis. What kind of trouble did it cause you, Maria? It's been over a year doing physiotherapy and all, even when lifting a fork, depending on the day, I had to let it drop. I felt a shock here. And now? I'm not feeling anything anymore. I just couldn't raise my arm. How high could you raise it? If I raised my arm, then I would have to use the other hand to lower it because of the pain. Let's see if this endocondylitis is gone. Raise your arm. Where's that evil now, sister? I don't feel anything. It went back to the enemy and it will never return to attack her nor anyone else here. Amen, Jesus. Now I want to pray with you. God, thank you very much for these three revelations. And mainly, O oh God, because your praise endures forever. That which came from you, I gave to you. That which I gave to you is before you as a testimony of me. And likewise, of the friend who is praying now. May we know how to give you the best praise. In the name of Jesus, touch this life and bless it. Amen. Amen.